Hello guys, welcome back. So my my patron demon is so happy with himself. He he's actually proud of the term demon. We we've discussed it. They're all proud of the term. They they like it. They'll wear it as a badge of honor. So you know, Asmodeus is very proud because I did not know that there was sexy Asmodeus art. I knew it existed for Lucifer and I knew it existed for Satan. I had no idea that Asmodeus got his portion as well, and he's very pleased with himself. And the art I saw today, and I just stumbled across it on Pinterest, because Pinterest, um, it was, Ismodius popped up out of nowhere, so I was excited about that, and it was sexy Ismodius art, so that was even better. Um, now we're going to have a strange chain fetish in this house, <laughs> giggling back here. And it it's just, it was the, remember that god I told you I saw a couple years ago in my dream? So it was like buck ass naked and walking around and these witches were worshipping him. It was Asmodeus. So he's very proud of himself. And Mammon is of course super grumpy Mammon's today. Um, he, he, he doesn't like his his pet names you know how i am i give them all baby names and you know pet names and i talk stupid talk to them <laughs> and you know asmodeus eats it off he adores it it's like you call him snowy and all these pet names i i called um i called mammon wolfles exactly once and i got this look and suggested i never do that again um he is loving but he's he's also very cranky um, so today he's very cranky because, you know, the stimulus package is supposed to, supposed to go through. And, you know, we're all supposed to, almost all of us get money unless you're like incredibly well off, like making over 75000 a year, I, I think he'll be getting something. So like everybody watching and I will, you know, hopefully be getting a check. Now it's a one-time check. It's not, we're going to get this check every month. So don't go out, spend it before you have it. Um. And I was thinking I could get a, you know, I could get that wolf for Odin as thank you for making it through the virus, as thank you for making it through these trying times and everything else. And I'm I'm getting this energy of the hell you wear. Well, you're going to get that check and you're going to put it away. And, <laughs> and let me tell you something, young lady. You did a bottle of Coke. <laughs> And I actually sort of feel bad and guilty, and Asmodeus was like, oh, shut up. She feels bad enough as it is. Leave her alone. So <laughs> Asmodeus rescued me. Man was not done with his financial lecture yet, but, you know, it's it's how he shows his love. He will really ride your fire strings every penny. I mean, I'll look at a game on Game Jolt for 49 cents, and he goes, that's why you get where you need where you need us to manifest money for you. No. So <laughs> That's how I heard all, the, all all this morning. I went on Game Jolt. No. It's 49 cents. No. <laughs> that's, that's all I've been hearing. But I love him and I thank him. He gets upset because he doesn't like to have to be like that. But I know I can be a bit of a libertine. Um, I've already seen 20 different games I would have liked to buy because they were only 49 cents. And you know, if a magical check dropped out of the sky from a relative I didn't know of, well, he still wouldn't let me spend it, so <laughs> he's very ultra-conservative, though, but, you know, he's right. If, uh, you know, I'm always like, oh, what if I need this repaired? What if I need that repaired? That's why we're putting the money away if we get it. I'm, I'm like, still on the fence. I'm like, mm, I still think they're going to dig around for a month or so and see if they actually have to do this. Honestly, I've lived in this country all my life, and if the government doesn't have to give you something, they won't. I can tell you that right now, but, you know, we're all in good spirits. We're relatively happy. Um, I think either Asmodeus or somebody put their paw into my Amazon order. I checked on the Amazon order. Now they're saying that the medicine won't be in stock. First, it was going to be in stock the end of this month, remember? Then, like, first week of April. Now it's sometime in May, but mine's supposed to be coming Friday, but they haven't shipped it yet. And I'm as confused as hell. But the two little items I tucked into the order, those shipped. The non-essential items, those shipped. So I'm confused, but I'm like, hey, okay, if it shipped, it shipped. So we're, we're doing okay, and we're going to have some chicken and rice in a little bit, I think. And we're, we're waiting for two tiny orders to come in because, um... 
Amazon's, you know, sending stuff in dribs and drabs, which is okay because at least, it, you know, at least it's coming and I don't want workers sick and everything else. And we're in good spirits, but at the same time, you know, we are watching the news and we're like, you know, it could be a couple of weeks, yet goes a couple of months that you have to be careful. Um, some countries are coming out from under it, like China and stuff like that. And, you know, thank the gods for that. And some of us are going into it, and how bad it's going to be is how much self-discipline we can have. And I'm like, oh dear. So, you know, it's, it's, we're just going to have to be careful for the next couple months. But we know that, you know. We know that even when everybody is relatively happy and healthy, if you're, you know, you're like me and you have chronic issues, I know if there's like a cold going around or something, I will pick it up. Even if I'm in my home. You know, I can still pick up stuff just from, you know, picking up my mail or getting packages sent or something else. And I'm not trying to make people paranoid, but I have that kind of immune system where, you know, ideally I probably should be living in a, you know, room somewhere with ventilated air and everything else. But I I'm doing good. You know, I'm doing good. I've been relatively healthy so far. And we're just working on adjusting to the idea of, you know, I, I work with the demons. And they wear it as a badge of pride. I ask them, do you prefer the term demon or God? They'll respond to either. Um, and since they know when I say demon, I don't mean it in the negative Christian sense. They're fine. Um, but, you know, you do you and you do what it seems that they respond to with you. Some people get really prickly and they go, they're gods. Don't you dare call them a demon. But, you know, demon just means wise one. And in the classical sense, people would have worked with demons because they would have been seen as like your personal tutor or the spirit that was most attuned to you, that wanted to teach you and help you learn and grow. The Christian sense of them is very warped in that they're just going to indulge you and give you stuff and it's like no they're just like any other deity or spirit where they're going to be the ones to you know close the purse strings and they're going to be the ones to not let you indulge constantly and everything else when nobody knew what was happening in the world mammon was indulgent and he was okay with it but he's already starting to tell me no which is a good sign <laughs> you know he's like no he's you know he's not like passing on secret information but he's like you have to get back to normal you have to get back to spending more carefully being more thrifty not going to the gas station just because you have done so well and now you know like t two visits in a row you picked up a bottle of coke no 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 this this ends now and now i'm not touching the coke i'm like i feel bad now so i said i, I might leave it in there for easter and i celebrate secular easter though you could celebrate you know, Ostera on that day, because I don't think anybody was in the mood to celebrate Ostera and, you know, Spring Equinox when it actually happens. So that might be an idea if you just haven't been in the mood, wait to Easter, see where things are, celebrate then, or celebrate whenever, you know. I don't think the gods care that we celebrate on a specific day just so we can. But... We figured we would catch you guys up. Asmodeus is very pleased with himself. We'll probably waste some time today on Pinterest and just, you know, we're waiting to see when our order is going to come in. It usually doesn't come in this early, but sometimes it can. But it can come in any time between now and, like, say, 4 or 5 o'clock. So we're just going to wait around for our order today. So if you guys like what you see, like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you later. Bye-bye.